Thank you very much, Brian Shackman. And we now uh, have some breaking headlines. Michelle Caruso Cabrera has them. Michelle? Let's bring up an intraday chart of General Electric. GE says it is the victim of a hoax. The hoax is as follow. At 9.47 this morning, a story crossed the Associated Press saying that General Electric was going to pay back a $3.2 billion tax refund and that it would phase out tax havens over the next five years. General Electric says that is a hoax. You can see that the, the uh, stock moved when that story crossed the wires. The next thing to figure out here is how did this cross the Associated Press wires? Was is this a hacking job or did somebody get something wrong? We're working on that now. But General Electric says this is a hoax. This is not a true story. We are working on it more, but they are not going to phase out tax havens. That would have been a clue maybe that something was wrong with the story, that phrasing. And also the entire $3.2 billion tax refund that they were supposedly going to pay back. Remember, they didn't actually get a check. Uh, so there are some errors in the story, story that crossed, but that is a hoax. Guys, back to you. All right. Can't wait to see exactly how that happened, whether it was an error or purposeful. In the meantime, let's talk about J.P. Morgan, because it really remains the center.